This is our fixed partner, Emily. She's a 19-year-old engineering student from Brunel University. Um, when I was 30, I had scoliosis, which is where your spine goes into an S shape. I had corrective surgery on it, but they mucked it up, and I got permanent nerve damage down my left side, which caused mobility issues. And then the rods are up too high in my back, so they rub against my top vertebrae, which causes migraines, which lead to blindness. We found that Emily had lots of equipment to help her with her back, but nothing for her blindness. She showed us how she gets around her room when she's blind. So I can basically pull myself along, and then I can reach from here, from my um, wardrobe, and then I'll open it up, pull myself up, hold on, and follow the route along. So I guide myself along with my leg, and then when I get to the end, I know that all I've got to do is turn around. So I follow the route from my bath mat along, and I know that my sink is halfway in between. We decided to design a system to help her in her periods of blindness. We decided to build a rig of Emily's room so we could test out some ideas. We ensured it was a scale model of her room. This way. We decided to focus on Emily's movement around the room and food storage for her during the migraines and then carried out some testing using some blacked out goggles. After testing, we came up with some design solutions and started implementing them in the room. We made some textured handles to categorize different foods. That's 60 centimeters. We then worked on ways for Emily to navigate her way around the room. We created a raised strip to guide her between the key points in her room. We also designed a bedside table and a corner grip for her room, but found that they were impractical solutions for a university residents because we couldn't make permanent additions. On the windowsill, we installed food containers with textured handles on them and a padded headboard with a section cut away so she could actually reach the boxes. We tried to fit with the theme of the room when making the guides so they were less intrusive. Um, in the last week of term, Saskia and George came and installed all the stuff in my room. Um, I found it really helpful because I had a migraine, so like the different feelers going around my room and stuff was really helpful leading to my bathroom. And then um, my new headboard, I can reach behind to get all my stuff um, off of my windowsill. And then like all the different containers with the different feelers and stuff were really good when I can actually see what I was looking for.